In this video, I am going to show you how to enable notifications on your Fitbit Versa 3 and what are all the options you get to manage the notifications. To better explain, I will be enabling Fitbit Versa 3 WhatsApp, email, messenger and call notifications. So let's first start with how to enable notifications on Fitbit Versa 3 for the first time after setting up your watch. Open the Fitbit app, tap on the profile icon in the corner and now click on Versa 3. On the next screen, tap on the notifications option under general. This will bring you to the page asking you to enable notification service. Here tap on the option, this will take you to the permissions page. Make sure to grant the app permission as otherwise it won't be able to read your notification. Once you have granted the permission, come back to the Fitbit app. Here you will see that now you can access calls, text messages, calendar events, emails, app notifications and reply settings option. So you can turn on call alerts by toggling this option on. Next is text messages. Tapping on it brings you to the page where you need to select your default messaging apps. So if your primary messaging service is WhatsApp, then select it or leave it as the default messaging app. Next up is the calendar event. So depending on the default app you have or third party app installed, you get the option to select them as well. The same is the case with email. So if you use Outlook, then you can select that as well. It's time to talk about Gmail notifications. If you enable Gmail notifications on Fitbit Versa 3, you start getting email notifications. However, during my usage, I found them to be slightly delayed. Once you receive an email, you can tap on it to read it. You get three options to interact with the emails. You can archive the email, open it on your phone or dismiss it. If you can't see the email notification, then I would recommend checking if you have selected the right default email app. Another issue sometimes Gmail users face is that they accidentally enable priority notifications only. So if you won't receive notifications on your phone, then you won't be able to see them on your watch. Next is the calling notification feature on the Fitbit Versa 3. Once enabled, you can see the caller ID on your watch screen. Using the watch, you can accept and reject calls on your phone. After picking up the call, you can adjust the speaker volume as well. You can also transfer the call from your watch to the speaker or switch back to the watch. There is also an option to disable the microphone on the watch. You can also use a numeric keypad during the call which can be useful during automated calls. You can also enable notifications for individual apps as well. Next up is some reply option. Here you can enable voice replies for messages. Once enabled, you will be able to use your voice to reply to messages. You can use it, but it isn't reliable enough in my opinion. Instead, I recommend setting up and using the quick replies option. You can type in your individual custom messages for different applications. And it won't be universal for all the apps. Next is how you can enable WhatsApp notifications on Fitbit Versa 3. It will be the same for how you enable notifications for all the other apps. Open your Fitbit app, go to Profile, Versa 3 and open notifications under the general option. On the next screen, open app notifications and look for WhatsApp. Then make sure to tap on the checkbox next to it. Now whenever you get any WhatsApp notification, you can read it by simply tapping on it. After that, you get a bunch of options on the watch. The first one is the voice to text feature. It isn't reliable enough for daily usage as it works sometimes and other times it does not. The next option is the emoji. You can select and send multiple emojis to a particular chat as well. This icon in the center allows you to access the quick replies. Using it, you can send a quick reply text. Both the quick reply and emoji reply functions work reliably all the time. By the way, you don't get notifications for WhatsApp calls. You will only get missed call notifications once the calls get disconnected. Next is how you can enable Facebook Messenger notifications on Fitbit Versa 3. It will be the same for how you enable notifications for all the other apps. Open your Fitbit app, go to Profile, Versa 3 and open notifications under the general option. On the next screen, open app notifications and look for messenger then make sure to tap on the checkbox next to it. Now you will be able to receive all your Facebook messenger notifications on your Fitbit Versa 3. 
Once you receive a message, you can tap on it to read it. You can respond to messages either by emojis, quick reply or voice to text option. Similar to WhatsApp, you don't get notifications for calls. You only get missed call notifications once the calls get disconnected. So guys, that was it for today. Don't forget to press that like button and subscribe to our channel. We come out with wearable tech videos like this almost every day. So subscribe. See you here tomorrow.